Hello and welcome to ETCV 510, Learning Theory and Instructional Design. I'm Chris Johnson and I'm your instructor for this course. I'm also pleased to have Forrest Pope as a preceptor for this course. So during the course, there are several ways to get in touch with me. One, you can always email me. Or you can text or call 520-991-7304. Now, if you do call, I appreciate calls between, say, 8 a.m. and 9 p.m. And if you're not on my call list, um, it'll go to voicemail, but I do try to answer those as quickly as possible. But probably the best way to get a hold of both Forrest and myself is through our Slack accounts. So uh, I'm CGJ and Forrest is F. Pope. So we'll be using Slack for a lot of the class communication. You want to make sure that you use that uh, direct message channel to get in touch with both of us. So let's take a little bit of a look at the course. The purpose of the course is to explore the historical and current learning theories as they relate to creating digital learning. We'll begin with an overall introduction to learning theory starting with some readings from how people learn, and then you'll also be watching some videos and doing some other readings. As I mentioned, we'll be using Slack for our discussion forums and also to, for you to have conversations with each other or with Forrest or myself. We'll begin with a historical look, starting with behaviorism and cognitivism. And then we'll advance to more uh, recent learning theories, one related to constructivism, and we'll learn a lot about Vygotsky's zone of proximal development. And then also look at a relatively new theory called connectivism. And finally, you'll explore a number of current learning theories to see how they can be applied to digital learning. So it's a seven and a half weeks course. It's accelerated. You want to make sure that you keep up on the readings. And if at any time you get into any trouble, uh, get behind on anything, please make sure that you reach out to either Forrest or myself. And because we want to make sure that you have a good learning experience in this course. So we both look forward to work. No, I can't talk. We both look forward to working with you during the course.